Hi everyone, it's your fave, Layla, and if you've been keeping up with the Bloxburg series, you would know that I am pregnant. So, I wanted to show you guys my Toka Life World pregnancy routine before I have the baby in Bloxburg. But let me go ahead and address the house situation. So, in Toka Life World, we all still live in the same house just because it's way more convenient. But in Bloxburg, Adrian and I have our own house house and we love it make sure you catch up with this series if you haven't already speaking of adrian who is my baby daddy looks like he's already up and out the door but i do have a doctor's appointment today and it's very important it's the last one before i have the baby and he's going to meet me there for that and i'm just hoping and praying that everything looks good with the baby and with myself as well also, ever since I got pregnant, I've been spending less and less time on my phone, which is really crazy for me, but I'm trying to get in the habit of not getting on my phone the moment I wake up. I have other priorities, and I could literally sit here and scroll for hours. Because if y'all didn't know, I used to be the TikTok queen, and if you don't know, you better ask somebody. But I have also been experiencing a lot of back pain, which is so annoying, so I can't even throw it back anymore. Once I have this baby, I will be able to. And also, speaking of the baby, let me show you guys what we have over here. So, this is where our baby's crib is currently. Until they're old enough to, you know, have their own room and stuff, I think it's really just intimate to have the baby in our room with us. I know it might get a little frustrating if the baby's crying or whatever, but we'll be able to handle it. So we have a heater, of course, that is very important, and it gets really cold in here really quickly. That's that, and then, of course, the crib, which I am obsessed with. Then there's a side table, and this is where I'm going to put down all of the stuff in this box. So let's go ahead and do a little unboxing, I guess. First thing we have is this little frog statue. By the way, this is just a lot of stuff that my mom gave me. It's nothing new, but anyways, thanks mom. So the next thing is this bottle warmer. And we have a little baby bottle as well, and we can put that inside and then turn it on, and there we go. So we can just put the bottle right here. Then we have Mr. Bear. Oh my gosh, this is Livy, my little sister's. I guess she's going to let her little niece or nephew have it, because y'all know how much she loves this thing. So that is so sweet. And then the last thing is just this little baby monitor walkie-talkie. And that is everything in the box. So now I can continue with the rest of my morning routine. Actually, before I leave the room, I need to go ahead and take my medicine. And now that that's done, we can go to the restroom. Another pregnancy problem that I've been having is that I have to pee all the time and drinking that water just now did not help so i'm gonna go ahead and do that and i'll be back because y'all need to see all that okay so all done doing that and let's just turn on the sink and i will just wash my hands and after i'm done washing my hands of course i'm gonna brush my teeth so let's get my toothbrush there we go and let's get the toothpaste as well which is right over here and put that on there and now I'm gonna run my toothbrush under the water and I'm gonna sit down while I brush my teeth because my back is aching it's really giving grandma all right y'all I'm all done brushing my teeth and now I'm quickly just gonna wash my face much better because I don't look like death anymore so the next thing I'm gonna do is just a little easy workout. I do have a yoga mat in the living room, so I'll use that in a second. But the first thing I'm gonna do is use this yoga ball that my mom suggested, and it definitely has been helping a lot. 
I'm just gonna do a couple exercises on here, and then when I'm done with that, I will start doing a little light walk on the treadmill, because walking outside in this heat is way too much for me. All done with that, so let's get to walking on this treadmill, and let's turn it on. And this is about the speed that I always go, nothing too crazy. Y'all know I used to do gymnastics, and I'd always have to warm up and condition for that. And now the fact that I can barely even walk half a mile is so irritating to me. Pregnancy is not for the week. Alright, I'm done with that. And I know Dr. Harris has been telling me to make sure I stay hydrated. So I'm going to take this water and we're going to head to the living room to finish up and just cool down by doing some yoga. I had to sit down because it is so hard for me to catch my breath, but this yoga routine is so fun. So here is my yoga mat right here, and I'm just gonna lay it down in this open section. Okay, the video is on, and this is the first exercise that we're doing. This is so relaxing. Oh, she's moving kind of quick today. Okay, now we're going over here, and she's touching her toes, but I can barely even do that. And now we're going to go in the center, and we kind of just repeat this. So, back to this one, and then we're going to do it one more time. Try to touch my toes, even though it's more like touching my kneecaps. And now we're going back to the center. Now that that's done, I'm gonna move this out of the way so if somebody comes home, they don't trip and fall over it. There we go, just put that there. And now it's time for my favorite, breakfast, because it is the most important meal of the day and I've been making the most yummy breakfast ever. It makes me happy, but I feel like it also makes the baby happy too because it is the only thing I can really eat without getting sick. Okay, so I'm going to have to make this pretty quick because I still do online college classes. And then I have to head out the door to go to my appointment. I cannot be late for that. So, this is what I do for breakfast. First of all, I'm going to turn on the stove and heat up the pan. And I'm going to take some oil as well and put that in the pan for my eggs because it is a lot healthier than using butter. Looks like somebody already rinsed off the plates in the sink. So I'm going to take this one and just put it here. And I'm also going to need this spatula so I can flip my eggs. So let's go ahead and crack it and put it in the pan. And let's flip it over a little bit. I don't want my eggs cooked too much. So there we go. I like a little runny egg. I love popping the yolk, it's my favorite. And then I'm going to get some bacon out of the fridge as well. And I'm also going to get this basket of strawberries and just put them there because I'm going to cut those up later. And let's open that and I'm just going to fry up the bacon. Now we can turn off the stove and we can put this back in the sink. Let's go over here and combine these two. Perfect! This is my favorite meal ever. And I also need this knife right here. Let's just run it under the water really quickly. And let's cut up some strawberries. Perfect! I don't need too many and I don't want to eat them all. So we're just going to put those on the plate. Open up the fridge. Put these back. And I like to clean up immediately after I cook. So I'm going to take this towel right here and just wipe off the stove as well as where I cut the strawberries and there we go that is my breakfast of champions now I'm just gonna wait for my professor to join and while I do that I'm gonna eat mm. this class is gonna take a while and I'm probably gonna have to rush to get out the door so I'll see you guys once it's over. It is about time that that class is over. So let's go ahead and just close all those tabs and then close my laptop. And now I just need to get ready so I can be on time for my appointment because they will end up skipping me and I cannot have that. 
Hey y'all, so we just got to my doctor's appointment and I changed into one of the maternity gowns and you can clearly see my baby bump right now and it just makes me so happy. Me too, babe. I just can't believe that we're gonna have a little one running around soon. Well, 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 lovebirds. I hope I'm not intruding, but it is time for your appointment. I hope you didn't forget. Hi, uh, nice to meet you. My name is Dr. Coleman. You must be Layla and Adrian. Yeah, I was just about to say, you do not look like Dr. Harris. Yeah, definitely not. Uh, where is Dr. Harris? I hope you don't mind, but Dr. Harris is going to be out today. Something came up last minute, but she promises that she will be here for the arrival of your guys' baby. Well, let me go ahead and get set up, and you just go ahead and get comfortable, okay? Yeah, let's get you back on this bed. And I am going to sanitize my hands, of course. There we go. So, it seems like everything with your vitals came back perfectly. Um, I did see that you've been having some problems with heartburn and back pain, and Dr. Harris did prescribe you some medication for that. So, how has the medication been affecting you? Honestly, the medication has been helping a lot, but it has been making me really tired. Ah, I see. Yes, drowsiness is one of the side effects of the prescription, but hopefully you won't need it much longer because you're really close to your due date. Now go ahead and take a couple deep breaths for me slowly. And now let's carefully have you get up out of that bed. And let's take you over here so we can do your final baby scan. So let's put that there. And now here we go. Here is the first scan. Your baby looks great. I can't believe we're gonna meet our baby so soon. And now if I zoom in just a little bit more, here is the next image. This machine is a little outdated, so let's just give it a second and the pictures should be out soon. Okay everyone, well that is going to be it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please feel free to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! There's nothing